Hello everyone and uh, welcome back to the channel. So today I'm doing a follow-up video to the trim waterproof a bathtub window with a glue up tub surround video. A lot of you have asked for this and so uh, let's get into it. Okay so uh, here it is. Let's uh, start at the back side. I've taken the shower doors off here so everyone can see what it looks like and get a little bit better view that way. I'm also using a flashlight here to help me show this to you because with that window right there Kind of messing with the exposure on my camera and it's uh, kind of making the video a little dark everything's holding up really nice here i haven't done any more to it since uh, i put it in about seven years ago it's actually just a little more than seven years now but everything's staying glued up really nice but i mean i'm really satisfied not with just how this turned out you know it's actually been really durable and that i haven't had to do anything since i put it up so uh so there's the uh, trim for the window right there. I'm going to give you a close-up view of that here in just a minute. Like I said, this has just been fantastic. I've had absolutely no trouble with this whatsoever. I'm really satisfied with this whole thing and how it turned out. You know, considering this is the first time I ever put one of these up. So uh, let's take a look at the uh, window trim here. Let's see how that looks. If I don't fall and break my head open. Okay. So, if you look right here, you can actually see, you can see the crack that I put in that trim piece when I got it a little too cold and uh, pushed it a little too far when uh, I was bending it. So all I did was put some caulk over the top of that and it's been just fine. It hasn't leaked a bit. So let's take a look at the rest of it here. See everything's holding up. The caulking is holding up okay. Everything around the window, caulking is holding up just great. I mean, really, it's it's just continued to look absolutely excellent ever since I put it up. Part of the reason for that is one of the things that uh, I've kind of learned with this particular tub surround. If you wanna, if you want it to keep looking good like this, it's really super important to keep it clean. So every time I get done with a shower you know, or a bath or something like that, what I do is I rinse it, I rinse the, the mid, uh, I rinse the surround down with just this cup right here, uh, get some water in the cup, pour it down the walls, pour it down the uh, shower windows or the shower doors, and then after I do that, I use this squeegee right here to squeegee everything down, and then after that, I use this rag right here to wipe everything dry and I do I've been doing that religiously every single time that I take a shower I use that same procedure I also use that that uh, what's that cleaner called that scrubbing bubble stuff and uh, I do that about every two months or so and uh, that's really all I I do to maintain it and to keep it looking like this all right so there's a look at the uh, tub surround that I put up seven years ago I hope you enjoyed this look at it, how everything's holding up. If y'all have any questions, do me a favor, drop down in the comments below. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you have any uh, questions. Also, it will really help my channel out a lot if you would uh, subscribe and uh, also hit that notification bell so you know when new content drops on Slick Rides Garage. All right, that's going to do it for this time. I appreciate each and every one of you, and uh, we'll talk to you next time. Later.